Almighty, we are here in Manhattan, across from Central Park. Because the Zionists have decided, of course, to present to the world that they are the representation of Judaism and to tell that New York stands with the murder, the killing of the people in Gaza. We want the world to know that they are a bunch of low liars. They are nothing more than criminals. They're using the name Israel, naming them Judaism, claiming the speaking name of Judaism, claiming that New York stands together with them. This is all patently yourself. false. Your parents taught you hate. You Judaism states clearly you learn not to kill or steal. We are. as Jews around the world, you in Palestine, in Iraq, in Palestine, Palestine, in Al-Quds, in Jerusalem, we from. cry, we hurt with the people of Gaza that are being from. slaughtered, mass murder Shut every up. single day now. We plead with the world. These Zionists, they're using my religion as a camouflage to masquerade, to legitimize their occupation, to stifle the voice of anybody who wants to stand up for compassion. A Jew is up. not a Zionist, and a Zionist is not a Jew. But they're here they're standing in the name of our religion in a total, a total masquerade, a total uh, a con job. That's what it is. We cannot accept this. We will not accept it. We want the world to know the Torah forbids us to occupy, to kill, to steal. The Torah forbids us to have our own state. The rabbis around the world and the very religious communities from the streets of Al-Quds, from the streets of Jerusalem, to the streets of New York, around the world. In New York, now the second largest community of Jews, we are all in opposition to this occupation. We all cry and hurt with the suffering of the people of Gaza. And the people that were killed, these 1,400 people, is also purely because of the Zionist occupation. We will not be silent. We say that the personification of anti-Semitism is the state of Israel. Their name should be the state of anti-Semitism. They are here, their hands are covered in blood of the Palestinians every single minute of the 24 hours of this day. People are dying and lying in excruciating pain, suffering from the wounds that they got from the bombs that are being dropped on Gaza. We dare not be silent. This is all together with the Jewish blood that since they've established their state, since they moved Zionism to the Holy Land, there is hate, animosity. They are the ones that are causing this because they are occupying, stealing, oppressing. What is the result? We don't condone violence, but that is the that is the reaction to an action. That's what you has to come about. They are the cause of this. How does not the world hear that they that their intelligence is being insulted? The world's intelligence is simply being insulted. You see that Jews lived together in harmony for hundreds of years. What changed? The advent of Zionism. Since then, this hate, this bloodshed. How does the world go in lockstep with the Zionists and support them and say, yes, we'll kill Hamas. Yesterday was the PLO. How could they say that? Don't they realize by doing so, they're furthering the deep animosity and the deep rift between Jews and Muslims that used to live together in peace. This is not a religious conflict. This is a flawed, selfish occupation that is causing blood. Stop the blood. Cease and desist. Bring an immediate end to the people who are being blockaded in Gaza. Bring an immediate end to the occupation. It's entirety of Palestine. We will have peace. We will be able to give the Palestinians back their homes, their dignity, and we will be able to live in peace, and the Jews, together with the Arabs, will live in peace and enjoy each other's company. God should help sooner nowadays.